Hello, this is Keith from uh, Keith's Bear Reviews. Um, I'm going to do my first outside review today. The heat wave, total heat wave, is finally broken. Um, I'm going to do a, another beer from uh, a Millstream Brewery here in Iowa. I'm going to be doing the uh, the Shield Brow Amber. Uh, I have had this before. Um, from the website, they say the name Shield Brow means essentially solid beer in German. This is our flagship brew. A microbrew done in the style of the special beers of Munich. This beer is brewed in the style of a Vienna lager. Our beer uses these same malts to attain a perfect balance between malty sweetness and a firm bitterness. The repeated awards that we have received for this beer only confirms why so many people consider this beer to, to be synonymous with Millstream Brewery at its best. Um, comes in at 4.9% ABV, 16 IBUs. Um, just bought myself a, I'm not going to do any fancy tricks with it, but I just bought myself the uh, the BB Barfly. So, I bought it. I'm going to use it to save caps. So let's get this in the glass and see what we have here. Okay, we got a nice amber beer slight orange tint um, almost copperish semi translucent you can see quite a bit of, of uh, carbonation coming up I'm not going to be doing a big long beer review here because the sun's going down um, let's get a smell and see what we got okay, it's a uh, mostly malty caramel and coffee fairly light uh, fairly light there is a bit of nuttiness this is a might even be a hint of chocolate. This isn't a real, real strong aroma, but it's a, it's a good solid smell for an amber. Give it a taste and see if it follows. Again, you get your malt, maltiness right up front. Uh, caramel, sweet malts. Um, caramel sort of diluted. Um, the, sm the, the taste follows the smell. It's it's not it's not a real heavy smell. It's it's a light smell, light taste too. You do get a a, a touch of slightly spicy hops in the finish. Uh, Mouthfeel is medium. I don't know if you can see it. The sun's behind the sun's behind the camera. There's quite a bit of uh, carbonation streaming up there. Um, so it's well carbonated. Um, that that helps in the finish. It's a light beer, light smell, light taste. The aromas are there. The tastes are there. They're where they should be. For me, they seem a little light, but let me let it warm up for a little bit, and we'll see what we have. Cheers, everybody. I'll see you in a few. Okay, I'm back. It's only been oh, 15 minutes or so. Uh, it's warmed up quite a bit. Um, as it's warmed up, not a lot has changed. It's still, you get your that caramel, uh, toffee, maltiness. Um, it might be a hint of butter. Um, maybe even a hint of chocolate. This be a good, oh, here comes the train. Let me, uh, let me stop this. I'm gonna. I'm only half a block from the train tracks now, so but when the train's done, I'll finish this. Well, that would that didn't take long. Fortunately, that was the Amtrak, very very short train, so um, not one of those big long three mile long freight trains that normally come through here and last forever. Um, overall, uh, this is a decent amber. Um, being, you know, at 4.9%, it's a decent session beer. It's drinkable. It's, you know, it's above average. Um, as, as, a, as a beer, as an amber, I'd probably give it a 7. Um, as a beer I like, probably maybe a, yeah, I'd give it a 7 too, so. Overall, the uh, Millstream Brewing uh, Shilburn Amber gets a 7 out of 10. Cheers, everybody.
Keep drinking good beer.